Hey guys, Yellowbone69 here, and this is the first piece in the new Taro 680 Pro Hexacopter build. Just came in the mail today, so uh, we'll crack her open and have a look on the inside. Alright, so we're one-handed here, but uh, she's all broken open, so let's have a look at this together. We got uh, pieces for the landing gear here. Woven carbon fiber tubing. All the arms. Oh, these motor mounts are massive. <laughs> Holy jeez. Awesome. And there's a few for the front. All the clips for the locking arms, pieces for the legs, like assembly, the attachments, more landing gear pieces. It's very well packaged, I must say. Here's the uh, battery tray assembly and a couple of uh, the hangers for the bars. Foam. And the piece de resistance. The board. This is, uh, the best part about this board is you solder your ESCs to it, so this is going to be very interesting. We got a little instruction package. I guess it's uh, pretty detailed. The only thing it doesn't say here is that you have to install your electronics while you're assembling, but maybe they want you to do trial and error to figure this shit out. Anyways. Package number one. So we'll start pulling things apart and see how much we can assemble before the rest of the electronics get here. Anyways, Taro 680. Hey guys, so I uh, picked up a few items to get the build going here. Got a new soldering iron and a little more detailed solder for PC work. And I uh, was checking the sizes, so I got a couple extra Allen keys. I didn't want to strip the ones I got just in case. And I decided to go with the red Loctite. I'm going to use that for the metal on metal. And when it comes to metal on plastic, I'll use the blue. Because this one is the medium, and this one's the high strength. So, generally I would think anything that we use metal on metal in the hexacopter build is probably going to stay for a while. Anything with the blue, eh, temporary. Can be changed. So, that's, uh, just got to get a rosin gun. And other than that, I'm ready to start building tomorrow. So, I'm going to have a bunch of little mini updates until we get her done. Thanks for watching.